Hey guys, Prohub 2010 with you today, and today I'm going to be showing you how to add a program or something to launch on your right click menu. So, when I right click, you see that I have this recorder option, and this is my Camtasia Studio, which I'm using right now to record this tutorial. So, I'll be showing you how to do that to easily access your programs just by right clicking on your desktop and having the option available right there. So, uh, let's go ahead and begin. You won't need any programs for this, you just need to use their computer in a built-in registry editor. So go to start and type in, in the search box reg edit and press enter. Now you're gonna have a, you're gonna have a menu like this. Make sure you click on the very first uh, on the first arrow H key classes root. Click on that and you're gonna see a lot of folders. You want to scroll down until you get to letter D and uh, once you get to letter D you want to find the directory folder. So scroll down just a bit more. I think it's no there you go. The directory folder right there. As once you find the directory folder, you want to click on this little uh, arrow on the side. Then you want to click on this arrow on the side for the background folder and also for the shell. So when we go here to the shell, you can see I already have my recorder folder, which which is this part right there. Uh, if you want to create, let's say for this tutorial, just for sake of this tutorial, I'm going to be uh, uh, building building in. Uh, video converter inside of the right click menu so uh, to, to add your own program you want to right click on the shell on the shell folder press new and press key title this whatever you want this is the name that's going to appear when you right click on your uh, on your desktop when the right click menu comes up so let me do video converter and press enter once you have done that you now want to right click on your video converter folder or the folder that you just have created you want to go to new and pre press key and in this key you want to call this command this is very important that you call a command or else it won't launch so click out of it and click on the folder on the folder command then you're gonna have a little uh, default key right there you want to double click on this and then you're gonna have to set the value data now the value data is going to be the file uh, the file destination so uh, go ahead to locate your file you can go to start uh, you can go to my, com my computer you can go to local disk C, uh, program files, and AVS for you, uh, AVS video converter, and here is my final file. So uh, I would copy this file location straight like this, and add this at the end. But if you have, uh, if you have a, let me just turn my icons back on. If you if you have an, a shortcut on your desktop, let me just find this shortcut. Uh, if you just let me say I have a shortcut, let me send to desktop and create a shortcut. All right, so if I have a shortcut on my desktop, you can just right-click and click properties, and you could just get this whole entire what's what's with what's inside the quotes. Don't copy the quotes. Just copy what's inside the qu quotes in the target area, and you could just use that because it already leads you straight to the file type. So double-click, value data, paste that in or just do it manually by going to my computer program files and selecting the file from there and just simply press OK and then exit out of your registry let me turn this back off so right click and press video converter and your program is starting that's it for this video guys if you have any questions please post them in the comment sections below I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible rate comment subscribe and I'll see you guys next time